but what I wanted to show you quickly was what we're eating for lunch right now as you saw us preparing it's the duck confit that I made probably a month ago and it's been just left in the pot with the duck fat over top of it to seal the meat in and it's actually supposed to kind of ferment like that but it also preserves it because no oxygen gets to it so really really good really tasty extremely tender and uh, no refrigeration needed. I did put it in the floor so it's at a uh, probably close to five degrees Celsius I would say so it's like refrigeration temperature and you can store it I don't know what the limit is maybe it is a month maybe two months and if you keep it frozen like that it could last obviously much longer but really really good this is like delicious mm -hmm. so this is basically round one and then we're having the, the uh, chicken and then probably pancakes for dinner dessert, Jimmy. for dessert pancakes for dessert yeah this is awesome it's so good. you like that one going to finish off the maple syrup um, sometime next week there wasn't enough really to make it worthwhile but once you commit to something like this it's, and uh, you know people coming up to visit want to uh, do what uh, you planned on doing so we did what we could with a little bit of maple syrup or maple sap that we were able to collect it just hasn't been warm enough yet it's nice and sunny and it's starting to flow right now but uh, only got up to two or three degrees right in the middle of the day so not a full day of, of um, sap uh, movement but this coming week, over the next few days, it's supposed to get up to perfect temperatures. So probably get five, six, seven days of, of good uh, sap movement, which means I can get, I don't know how much, how many gallons. There's 30 pails out and they're about a gallon each. So I would say should be able to collect two or three pails from each. So maybe 60, 90 gallons, something like that. That's what I'm hoping for. So we'll do another boil and uh, get to the consistency that we're looking for thicker than last year maybe even make some sugar and then uh, make some great meals with it. So I'm looking forward to doing that. So hopefully uh, my daughters and my wife come back up again next time and we 
cook some more meals and have a good time. I appreciate you watching the video and if you haven't subscribed, I know I, I never ask you to do that. Um, people do remind me, they say, you know, I didn't even know you could subscribe or what that actually even means, but uh, not a big deal. But if you do want to continue to watch my videos on both channels, then the easiest way to do that is to hit the uh, subscription button and the notification bell and then you'll be notified every time I put up a new video. Um, so if you can do that, I'd really like that, I'd, I'd appreciate it, but otherwise, I really appreciate you watching anyway. So they're going to take off and I'm going to clean up here a little bit more, cut some more firewood, and then uh, get back to work on the sauna tomorrow. So thanks for watching, I look forward to seeing you up with Kevin next time. Take care.